Rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just say your hour has come again. So wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. I thought so much of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here in the Citadel so thoughtfully provided by our benefactors. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. And so, whether you are here to stay or passing on your way to parts of the welcome to City 17. Must be a mistake. I got a standard relocation coupon just like everybody else. Why has the seen fit to suppress our reproductive cycle? Sincere. Family right. Of course, your question touches on one of the basic dialogue. Let me read the letter I recently received. Dear Dr. Green, why has the seen fit to suppress our reproductive sincerely? And one of the basic biological impulses, with all its associated hopes and fears for the future of the species. I also detect some unspoken questions. Do our benefactors really know what's best for us? What gives them the right to make this kind of decision for mankind? Will they ever deactivate the suppression field and let us through again? me.
name is Crystal. You know, from the mercenary group Star Fox. It's, uh, it's been a while. So, are you ready for some fun? Follow me. I knew you'd show up today. City 17 is no place to live. So we've been helping people escape through here. We're working on a much better way though. Hmm. Here, check this out. I'm really glad you could make it. We could really use your help. Lamar! Come out of there! Oh, everything all right, Dr. Oh, Kleiner? hello, Alex. Well, uh, almost all right. Thank goodness. Gordon Freeman. It really is you, isn't it? He ran right into that ambush. You're rather lucky I was there to save you. We owe a great deal. I must say, Gordon, you come at a very opportune time. Alex has just installed the final piece for our resurrected teleport. Oh no, I didn't do anything. Nonsense. Your talents surpass your lovers. <laughs> I wouldn't say that. Well, is he here? There you are. Man, Gordon, you stirred up the hive. We can't keep him here long, Doc. It'll jeopardize everything we've worked for. Don't worry. He's coming with me. Uh, that's right, Barney. This is a red-letter day. We'll inaugurate the new teleport with a double transmission. You mean it's working? For real this time? Because I still have nightmares about that cat. No, no. There's nothing to be nervous about. What cat? We've made major strides since then. Major strides. What? Cat? Doc, since he's not taking the streets, you might as well get him out of his civvies. What? Oh dear, you're right. I almost forgot. Barney, I'll give you the honor. <laughs> I've got to get back on my ship, but okay. Go. Ah, damn it, get it off me! Lamar! There you are! I thought you got rid of that pest. Certainly not. Never fear, Gordon. She's de-beaked and completely harmless. The worst she might do is attempt to couple with your head. Fruitlessly. Get that thing away from me! Here, my pet. Hop up. No, not up there! No, no! Careful, Lamar. Those are quite fragile! Oh, fie! It'll be another week before I can coax her out of there. Yeah, longer if we're lucky. Barney, you're not an animal person. Ugh. Well, Gordon, go ahead. Slip into your suit now. Position yourself near the panel over there and wait for my word. Isaac, are you there? Yes, yes, Eli. Bit of a hold up on this end. You'll never guess who found his way into our lab this morning. Uh, that's not who I think it is, is it? Indeed it is, and it's our intention to send him packing straight away in the company of your lovely daughter. Eli, are you ready for us? We're all set on this end. Then let's do it. Let's see. This field flux should self-limit, and I've clamped the manifold parameters to base and LT orbifold. No conditions. Conditions could hardly be more ideal. That's what you said last time. Hey, uh, yeah, about that shot. Finish my in three, two, one. So, fiddlesticks. What now? Uh, Doctor, the plug. Uh, dear me, you're right, Gordon. Would you mind plugging us in? It's right there, Gordon. Excellent. Are you going to let Gordon throw the switch? Gordon, go 
right ahead. Very good. Final sequence. Commencing now. I can't look. Um. Oh. Uh. Okay. Uh. Initializing in three, two, one. Uh, Barney, if you'll be so kind. Good luck out there, Gordon. Yes, indeed. We're ready to project you, Gordon. Bon voyage, and best of luck in your future endeavors. Final sequence. The hell? What is it? It's your head, the freaking head hopper! Are ready? No! Oh, yeah. Certain it was Gordon Freeman. He didn't come through. Then where is he? Behind you. Shut it down. Shut it down. You must get out of here. Run! Get down out of sight. I'll come find you. The Citadel's on full alert. I've never seen it lit up like that. Get out of City 17 as fast as you can, Gordon. Take the old canals, right? They'll get you to Eli's lab. It's, it's a dangerous route, but there's a whole network of refugees, and they'll help you if they can. I'd come with you, but I gotta look after Dr. Kleiner. Oh, and before I forget, I think you dropped this back in Black Mesa. Good luck out there, buddy. You're gonna need it.
You'll find more help up at Station 7. Just a few bends up the river. the border world and come back to the local space without having to pass through. Oh, here's a Eli now. All right, good. You keep right on. Eli, look who I found in the airlock. Gordon Freeman. <laughs> Let me get a look at you, man. My God, you haven't changed one iota. How do you do it? Now, let's see. The last time I saw you, I sent you up for help after the resonance cascade. I never thought it would take you this long to get back to me. Welcome to the lab, anyway. It's not Black Mesa, but it served us well enough. Ah, oh, Gordon. I thought I sensed you. You got here faster than I expected. I believe he broke your record, honey. Well, he earned it. I guess you've proved that you can handle yourself out there. There's nothing Gordon can't handle, with the possible exception of you. What's that supposed to mean? Uh... Take a look at this, Gordon. <laughs> Alex? I thought you were on watch. The Vortigaunts relieved me so I could come to see Gordon. Anyway, I should be in here working on the portal. I have the repairs well in hand. Someone misjudged the capacity of the Combine Thyristor. Are you blaming me? No, not at all. It was a calculation error, not a mechanical problem. Then maybe you should let me do the calculations next time, as well as installing it. Alex, really? Sometimes I think you deliberately misunderstand me. <clears throat> Alex, why don't you take Gordon along and give him some practice with the gravity gun? Sure. Come on, Gordon. Let's go and have some fun. The zero-point energy field manipulator is not a toy, Alex. Ugh. Let's get out of here. So, I see you've met Dr. Mossman. She really gets on my nerves. She goes on and on about how much better than you she is. I'm sorry, but I really needed to vent about her. You don't need a telepath to see just how full of herself she is. That's the old passage to Ravenholm. We don't go there anymore. So, here we are. The scrapyard.
This is the gravity gun Dr. Vance was talking about. You can call it the zero-point energy field manipulator if you really want to, though. It's designed for handling hazardous materials, but mainly we use it for heavy lifting. Have a go. The primary trigger emits a charge. You can punt stuff and send it flying. I found it handy for clearing minefields. The secondary trigger lets you grab things. You can throw them with the primary. Once you pick something up, you can drop it gently by pressing your secondary trigger again. Pick up some stuff and toss it. You can also pull stuff over from a distance. Try grabbing those barrels from that ledge up there. All right! See if you can stack some stuff to climb up here. All right! Now let me call Dog. He loves to play fetch. Dog, come! Good doggy. Gordon, this is Dog. Dr. Vance built him to protect me. First model was about yay high. I've been adding to him ever since. Haven't I, boy? Okay, dog, let's play catch with Gordon. You'll need to use the gravity gun. Go ahead, dog, throw! Put that down! What is it, dog? Oh my goodness, what was that? Scanners! The combine's sweeping the area. We've got to get back to the lab. Come on, Gordon. Do you read? Alex! Need... What's going on in there? Where are you, Alex? We're in the scrapyard airlock, stuck in a full auto cycle. Is Gordon still with you? He's right here. Good. I want you to... Dr. Vance? Take Gordon out of here. Head for the coast. Do not go through rape... Dr. Vance? Dr. Vance! Damn it! Dog, open the airlock. Get us out of here. Hurry, get out! Tear it apart if you have to. Just get it open. That's enough, dog. Come on, Gordon. Come on. Gordon, you need to get out of here. I can't leave, Dr. Vance. Dog. Take Gordon to the Ravenholm Tunnel and circle around and try to meet up with me. Hurry! Oh. 